Incoming transmission standby, welcome to the Nod News Network. President al-Sisi has stated that Egypt should adopt a one-child policy in order to cut its birth rate by five times. Abdel Fattah al-Sisi, the president of Egypt, has advised people to have a lot fewer children, claiming that the nation's current birth rate will lead to a catastrophe for the North African nation. Al-Sisi stated at the Global Congress on Population, Health and Development, PhDC, which began on Tuesday in Cairo, we need 400,000 births annually. The president told Health and Population Minister Khaled Abdel Ghaffer, I do not agree with your idea that having children is a matter of complete freedom, according to AFP. Leaving their freedom to those who may not be aware of the scale of the challenge. The Egyptian state and the entire population will ultimately bear the cost, according to al-Sisi. We need to organize this freedom, or it will result in disaster. He used China as an illustration, citing how it succeeded in their population control in the 1970s by enforcing a strict one-child policy. Following the policy's abandonment in 2015, Beijing has promoted population increase. Population increase can strain resources and infrastructure, resulting in health and social challenges, according to PhDC conference materials. A quickly expanding population compromises the availability and quality of basic services including health, education, and social security and leads to the rapid depletion of natural resources, according to the documents. Sponsors of the event include numerous UN agencies, USAID, and several significant pharmaceutical corporations. It started on Tuesday and will last until September 8. With an estimated 113 million citizens, Egypt is the Arab country with the largest population. In 2022, it registered over 2.2 million births. Al-Sisi has drawn attention to the economic strains that the country's population increase has put on it because it is now dependent on importing food from overseas. Cairo has asked Russia for more investments as a method to address its economic problems. Along with the UAE, Saudi Arabia, Ethiopia, Argentina, and Iran, it will join BRICS in January. This has been the Nod News Network, transmission complete.